Welcome to Mishnah Study Masachat Maaser Shani Perekad Mishnah Vav. Over here in this Mishnah, we're going to discuss if someone is redeeming his Maaser Shani. Right? So he has Maaser Shani coins and now he needs fruit. So he goes to the store, right? He purchases these, you know, fruits with these Maaser Shani money. And now the fruits become Maaser Shani. Now, let's say in the time of the transaction between when it was really, you know, uh, started till when it was complete, um, the, the value went up, right? Let's say, you know, you were buying apples that were worth, you know, a uh, dollar. And, you know, you, you, you by the time you were ready to pay, it was very worth $2. Um, now, what you need to know, the main part that really everything is built on is when it comes to transactions from the Torah, when does the transaction finish, right? When you actually, you know, pull the item, right? So once I lift the apples, the store, give, the store gives me the apples and I take them into my possession, right? That's already mine. I still need to pay him, right? But at that point, it's already considered mine, even if there was no um, money that was passed over from hand to hand. So that's going to be the discussion of Al-Mishnah. If a person, you know, actually pulled, right? He got, he, he actually held, the apples came into his possession, and at the time it was worth one selah. And he didn't get to finish redeeming, he didn't get to really to finish paying, right? Until the apples were worth two silaim, right? So he took it at one, but now he's coming to pay, now it's really worth two. Um, what does he need to pay? Technically, he only has to pay one, right? Because he already acquired it. So only all that he owes is one, and he benefited. Right, he gets to keep that extra sela for himself. So what does he do? No ten no sela, um istakir ba sela, um aser sheni shelo. He gives him one sela. He gives a store owner one sela. The he he benefits another sela. Right, he gets to keep that second sela for himself. He doesn't have to pay it out, and the maaser sheni becomes his. Right, meaning what? That now when he got the you know two silaim worth of apples, right? Now it's worth two silaim. So then he gets to keep that those two silaim. Next case in the Mishnah is the opposite. Right? He pulled it, right? He acquired it when it was worth two. Right? Two sedaim. He didn't get to pay until what? Until it was only worth one. Now he's losing money. He needs to pay, you know, two now. So now what does he pay from? Could he pay both from his Maaser Shani? So technically, it should be allowed. But the Mishnah says over here, no ten sela right? He needs to go ahead and give him one sela from his holim. Right? right, and he gives him one sela maaser sheni. So one sela maaser sheni is obvious because he's purchasing maaser sheni. So he gives him one sela maaser sheni. But the second one he needs to give from his own pocket. He can't give it as maaser sheni money. He needs to give it as hulin money. Right? And why? Why so? Because he needs to. Because we don't want the amharat, the person who is selling to, who's an amharat, it's to stumble. Right? If you're going to give him two coins of maaser sheni, right, that he's getting. And really, only one of them, you know, is real Maaser Shani. The other one is really Hulin. So he may not, uh, you know, he may not, you know, he, he could stumble, right? Let's say the Hulin, uh, let's say they become, they become Tamir. So he'll take the food and he'll throw it out, right? About the Shrit, maybe, right? So there's issues that may come up. So we say, no, you have to give one sela uh, from your actual Hulin. You can't give both from Maaser Shani. Right, other people are actually read it in the mouth, and Obama tr translates it as the uh, way he explains it. It's obviously he needs to read it as demayo from his demai. So if he was an amaharitz, you're allowed to give him from demai maaser sheni. Right, if you have maaser sheni demai, that you're already allowed to give him because it's not you know 100% maaser sheni. And the, and the, and the, the amaharitz is, is stumbling on other things. Right, so here that's not a problem. You can go ahead and give him the demai as the uh, as the second.